My check one two. Testing. Testing. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the H and P Arena on the campus of Texas Southern University. I don't talk that much. Check, 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 check. One, two, one, two, one, two. Check, check, check. Happy. This you can
Take flight with Texas Southern University, the only school in Texas that offers bachelor's degrees in both aviation science management and professional pilots. With the need to fill over 100,000 pilot positions in the coming years, TSU is poised to do its share to fill that void. So whether you're dreaming of becoming an airport manager or an airline pilot, Texas Southern University is the place to fulfill your aviation dreams. Learn more at aviation.tsu.edu. You. Life is about moments. If you fight, I fight. If I fight, we fight. You be there and watch what I do when the bell rings. Do you have that real look in your eye that when you look at yourself in the mirror, you can ask yourself this question? Did I give everything I got? Did I lay it all on the line? Or am I cheating myself? Whatever you're gonna do, claim it. Leave your mark on this world. Make the right moves. Hey, rocket moving. You need to call the people who always do it right. And work hard day and night. To make the right moves, you need people who Hello, Tiger Nation. This is Kevin Granger. I would like to personally invite you to come out and join the newly established TSU Athletic Directors Legends Club. Members of the TSU AD Legends Club will receive TSU Athletic Apparel, a championship ring from a select sport when applicable, season tickets for football, basketball, and the TSU Relays special recognition at a home athletic event, and much more. To join or for more information, visit tsusports.com or call 713-313-4355. And as always, Go Tigers! Welcome to Ascent Emergency Medical Center. Open 24 hours a day, seven days a week to treat adults and kids. A board certified emergency medicine physician will see you quickly after your arrival. With our state of the art equipment and on site certified lab, Ascent ER quickly detects medical problems in adults, kids, and pregnant women. Be treated quickly at Ascent Emergency Medical Center, located at Holcomb and Almeida. I'm not the type to say any of this mushy garbage. You know what? I'm going for it. You are completely and utterly... Awesome. I'm glad you showed up. In my life. I think I'm about to cry. You better not. Every single time I... Get down! You always have... My back. My back. It's really hard to describe. It's like all these tiny little things. Yes, yes, things. Are actually friendship. I'm Carlos Correa. I'm Slim Bowles. I'm Slim Thug. I recovered from COVID-19. Protect yourself and protect your loved ones and mask up. I want to encourage everybody to be a team player and mask up. Mask up like a champ to protect yourself and everyone else. As we reopen our city, it's important that we do it safely. Continue to wear your mask in public. Wear it like an all-star. Wear it like a champ. 
Wear it like a boss. Remember, we're all in this together. Mask up, Houston. with Texas Southern University, the only school in Texas that offers bachelor's degrees in both aviation science management and professional pilot. With the need to fill over 100,000 pilot positions in the coming years, TSU is poised to do its share to fill that void. So whether you're dreaming of becoming an airport manager or an airline pilot, Texas Southern University is the place to fulfill your aviation dreams. Learn more at aviation.tsu.edu. Life is about moments. If you fight, I fight. If I fight, we fight. You be there and watch what I do when the bell rings. Do you have that real look in your eye? That when you look at yourself in the mirror, you can ask yourself this question. Did I give everything I got? Did I lay it all on the line? Or am I cheating myself? What you say, Quaid? Whatever you're going to do, claim it. Leave your mark on this world. Tiger Nation. This is Kevin Granger. I would like to personally invite you to come out and join the newly established TSU Athletic Directors Legends Club. Members of the TSU AD Legends Club will receive TSU Athletic Apparel, a championship ring from a select sport when applicable, season tickets for football, basketball, and the TSU relays. Special recognition at a home athletic event and much more. To join or for more information, visit tsusports.com or call 713 313 4355. And as always, go Tiger! Welcome to Ascent Emergency Medical Center. Open 24 hours a day, seven days a week to treat adults and kids. A board certified emergency medicine physician will see you quickly after your arrival. With our state of the art equipment and on site certified lab, Ascent ER quickly detects medical problems in adults, kids, and pregnant women. Be treated quickly at Ascent Emergency Medical Center located at Holcomb and Almeida. 
I'm not the type to say any of this mushy garbage. You know what? I'm going for it. You are completely and utterly... Awesome. I'm glad you showed up. In my life. I think I'm about to cry. You better not. Every single time I... Get down! You always have... My back. My back. It's really hard to describe. It's like all these tiny little things. Yes, yes, things. Are actually friendship. I'm Carlos Correa. I'm Slim Bows. I'm Slim Thug. I recovered from COVID-19. Protect yourself and protect your loved ones and mask up. I want to encourage everybody to be a team player and mask up. Mask up like a champ to protect yourself and everyone else. As we reopen our city, it's important that we do it safely. Continue to wear your mask in public. Wear it like an all-star. Wear it like a champ. Wear it like a boss. Remember, we're all in this together. Mask up, Houston. with Texas Southern University, the only school in Texas that offers bachelor's degrees in both aviation science management and professional pilots. With a need to fill over 100,000 pilot positions in the coming years, TSU is poised to do its share to fill that void. So whether you're dreaming of becoming an airport manager or an airline pilot, Texas Southern University is the place to fulfill your aviation dreams. Learn more at aviation.tsu.edu. Life is about moments. If you fight, I fight. If I fight, we fight. You be there and watch what I do when the bell rings. Do you have that real look in your eye? That when you look at yourself in the mirror, you can ask yourself this question. Did I give everything I got? Did I lay it all on the line? Or am I cheating myself? What'd you say, Quaid? Whatever you're gonna do, claim it. Leave your mark on this world. Tiger Nation, this is Kevin Granger. I would like to personally invite you 
to come out and join the newly established TSU Athletic Directors Legends Club. Members of the TSU AD Legends Club will receive TSU Athletic Apparel, a championship ring from a select sport when applicable. Season tickets for football, basketball, and the TSU relays. Special recognition at a home athletic event and much more. To join or for more information, visit tsusports.com or call 713-313-4355. And as always, go Tigers! Welcome to Ascent Emergency Medical Center. Open 24 hours a day, seven days a week to treat adults and kids. A board certified emergency medicine physician will see you quickly after your arrival. With our state of the art equipment and on site certified lab, Ascent ER quickly detects medical problems in adults, kids, and pregnant women. Be treated quickly at Ascent Emergency Medical Center, located at Holcomb and Almeida. I'm not the type to say any of this mushy garbage. You know what? I'm going for it. You are completely and utterly awesome. I'm glad you showed up. In my life. I think I'm about to cry. You better not. Every single time I get down, you always have my back. My back. It's really hard to describe. It's like all these tiny little things. Yes, yes, things. Or actually, friendship. I'm Carlos Correa. I'm Slim Bowles. I'm Slim Thug. I recovered from COVID-19. Protect yourself and protect your loved ones and mask up. I want to encourage everybody to be a team player and mask up. Mask up like a champ to protect yourself and everyone else. As we reopen our city, it's important that we do it safely. Continue to wear your mask in public. Wear it like an all-star. Wear it like a champ. Wear it like a boss. Remember, we're all in this together. Mask up, Houston.
test, one, two, test, test, test. Come on, Ryan. Testing, testing. You got me? Okay. Okay. Welcome to the spacious H and P on the campus of Texas Southern University in between the game between the Rice University Lady Owls and the Texas Southern University Lady Tigers. I'm Kevin the Silver Fox Allen along with Robert Hatter here on the call today. How you doing today, Rob? Man, I'm doing great, man. Great glad to be back and get in the swing. And guess what? We get a chance to see Rice and Texas Southern. Uh, never seen Rice play before, but I get a chance to see, you know, give me a feel before the uh, season start and take a look at the Texas Southern Lady Tigers and see, uh, you know, see what we got. Hey, Texas Southern at the foul line right now with number 21, Michael Gray, a freshman here for the Lady Tigers, averaging 15 points a game. She's at the free throw line, and she makes the first. And, Robert, these are some of the ladies that you haven't seen before, but Michael Gray out of Oklahoma City yeah. is a player. Absolutely. I haven't seen her yet, but I told you in warm ups when I saw her, you, you pointed out that I said she looked like a player. You know, so you've been around the game alone, alone, you know, when you be around the game alone, you can see a player. You know, it, it doesn't take long. Yeah, it don't take long. There it you go. Take. Hey, she makes one out of two. Number five for the Rice Owls bring the ball up the court, which is Destiny Jackson, and, and the Rice is swinging the ball around. Tigers playing good defense, matchup man defense. Basket by the Rice Owls. Number 22, Ashley Austin, a senior out of Johns Creek, Georgia. Fouls out on Jada Belton, number five, another freshman. We're starting four freshmen and one sophomore. You know, I'm just watching the floor of the game. Rice off with offense rebound, 7 1. Cameron Bates bringing the ball up. Lady Tigers will be coming from left to right. They're asking about camera base here. Elisa Knight swing around. The turnover by Cameron Bates. Rice on the fast break on the push. That's Number Malia Fisher. Malia Fisher on, yeah. on the shots. Yeah, Jada Belton with the foul. Young freshman here, her second. And that's something that she's going to have to work on, Robert. She stays in foul trouble a little bit. As a freshman playing down low, that's something she's going to have to work oh, on. Oh, yes, absolutely. And as a matter of fact, you, you didn't use her second ago. You got four freshmen and one sophomore. Here you go. Let me tell you something. It's going to be some growing pains. Um, I mean, the freshmen just got to just trial by fire. Trial by fire. And let's just see if they can uh, rough up their defensive intensity. And, and then let's see what's, ha what's happening. Fisher makes both free throws. 9-1 outs over your Tigers. Cameron Bates bringing the basketball up. She's looking to set the pick. Zion Reynolds sets the pick. Bates passes along to Lisa Knight. Turnover Tigers. We've got to minimize our turnovers, Kevin. Young team have a propensity to turn the ball over. And, and number four, Adriana Avent shooting the three. No good. The microwave I used to call her <laughs> last year. Kevin. Destiny Jackson's bringing it up. Over to number one. Over to Crosswork. Over to Gooden for three. Good box out by Knight. She passed out on the outlet over to Cameron Bates. It's calling the play, bringing it up. And this is something that you said, Ro Robert, that the Tigers are going to have these growing pains. Now, these are some talented freshmen, yeah, but just playing talented. here. Yeah. But it's just some. Being a freshman, sometimes you're just unsure. You know, I'm watching the point guard. Cameron Bates. Physically, he's got it, but I see a little hesitant about maybe picking up a dribble too soon and, and too high. I just need him to keep the dribble down to one or two more dribbles and then uh, get the pace up and get the foul. And then we'll be able to hit him and, and pick and roll and get get some other stuff. I want to see us get the ball in the hand a little bit more. Lane touched the dribble too much. Other team in a bad position. A lot of pressure on him. Foul on number 32 for Rice. Trinity Gooden 
found Michael Gray. Michael Gray is up on line to make the first and the second. Rice is leading right now 9-3. to three. Another substitution in for the Lady Tigers to bring in number 44, which is Mary Apoklo, if I'm pronouncing that right. My Myopo, I'm sorry. Rice, number five. Jackson's in. Pick and roll with Austin. She picks it up. Lisa Knight on another rebound for the Tigers. Cameron Bates is bringing the basketball up. Across the timeline, calling the play. Coming with the pick and roll up with Zion Reynolds again. She's looking. Pass on the left side to Adrian Avent. Avent. Offensive foul, push off with Avent. A little bit of push off, Kevin. If I was a ref, I wouldn't have called that one. I mean, it's, it's no harm, no foul. She didn't gain an advantage from it. But I guess he's telling her, hey, we can't extend that arm like that. If you're going to have it out, you got to have it facing you. You can't put it out, hold it out like that. Put that chicken wing out. Yeah, you got to put that. <laughs> <laughs> Rice is bringing the basketball up from right to left. Destiny Jackson brings it up. Number one over the cross work. In the corner to Gooden. Gooden's in that three-pointer again. Rice is getting us on the boards at this time. Number 22, Ashley Austin. Gets the offensive rebound. I see something. They keep giving Gooden. Gooden shooting that ball like she knows what she's doing. She just hadn't made one. They keep giving her a look, look, look down the road. She's shooting it with confidence. She just missed it. But we got to get out and stop her. But I think she will see it. Gooden is at the free throw line. No, Austin, I'm sorry, makes the first shot. And the second. Tigers, Rice trying to do some little mini pressure there. The 11 to 3, Owls are leading. Cameron Bates in the lane. Ah, all the way to, there, to the cup and misses the layup. Good drive. This is something you said, putting the pressure in the lane. Yeah. Great touch. <laughs> Crosswords missed the three. Gets her own offensive rebound. Austin shoots the three. Mayor Mayopo on the rebound. Cameron Bates on the push. Calling out the play. Coming back with a high pick and roll with Zion Reynolds. Passes it over to Avent. Avent for the three. Misses again. Zion Reynolds with the offensive rebound over to Adrian Avent. Cameron Bates at the top. Getting into the lane. Bags it out. Real heady possession here for the Tigers over to Lisa Knight. Lisa Knight, shot clock is going down. Knight for the three, misses. Rice with the defensive rebound. We're looking at Malia Fisher on the rebound. Jackson on the push over to Fisher. Fisher on the left side to Gooden. They're defending Gooden this time. Crossword, misses a three. Zion Reynolds with the rebound over to Bates. Bates looking ahead, bring the basketball up. They're getting wide, wide open looks at, uh, at the three. We've got to prevent that, Kevin, because they'll start knocking those things down shortly. Avent on the drive. Foul on Rice, number five. Destiny Jackson, her first. And we have a media timeout. Four minutes, 52 seconds left. Listening to Texas Southern women's basketball.
one, two, three, yeah. moving, up. moving the back. There you go. Trying to put a little pressure to see yeah. if they could speed the yeah. speed the owls up. Something we said off air here. Yeah. Or just change the tempo. Change the tempo. Person just cross your face. You just let it cross your face and get a basket. Up. That was uh, number one. Number one, Fisher. Oh, oh, Malia Fisher. Cameron Bates bringing it down, trying to drive the basketball. Good Mayor. cut by Mayor Mayopo, and a foul on the tight on the Lady Owl. Mayopo, Mayopo came in and give energy. She hadn't did, but she got a little energy. She came to the basket. She's gotten the rebound. Stud here, driving back. Tigers are bringing in Michael Blake into the basketball game, Foul along with Tanea Lawson. Second year for the Tigers. I, I should have known Michael Gray wasn't going to be out of the game long. <laughs> now, you look on that court again now, and you, you have three freshmen yeah. and uh, a sophomore and a junior now. Michael Gray for three. Number 44 for Rice with the rebound. Shelby Hayes up to Jackson. Over to Ennis in the corner. And missed that. Rebound. Tania Lawson, and there's going to be a foul on number one. Malia, 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 Malia Fisher. Malia Fisher. But Malia Fisher is sporting the Garvin, uh, the David Space Garvin. Maybe she had a nose in it. Let the Malia go somewhere else to do it. She just said, <laughs> 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 at home. She got a, she, you know, I had a son that played in the Garvin, but I'm always happy to see Space go and see Garvin mm -hmm. play. Yeah, Tania Lawson is at the line shooting with one of them. She's shooting two shots. 13, 13-4 should be Rice leading Texas Southern. And this is some of the growing pains, one out of two. Yeah. <laughs> Rice pushes it up, brings it over to five. Jackson, the number three crossway comes up. Good defense by Avent. Got a trap in the corner, and she stepped out of bounds, picked up the turnover. Pressure bust it back, Kevin. <laughs> that was Jada Belton back in the game. She's going to come in for Zion Reynolds. There's another freshman on the court. So Coach Coach uh, Vernet Seat, like I say, has some talented freshmen. It's just going to take them a while it's before they click. Absolutely. They told me a long time ago, the only thing good about a freshman, they become a sophomore. Oh, yeah. Avent from the three in the corner misses it. Rice Fisher on the miss, on rebound. Over to Jackson. Her on miss. That'll go I over to Rice. I love watching them. I'm, I'm watching this new team. After watching the team last year, Kevin, it's, it's a breath of fresh air. They trying. I'm looking at them. They, 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 they're doing everything. But that's what it's for. Just young. This whole game is just a lot different. Look what they did in this one. Yeah, play Texas A&M tough until midway late in the fourth quarter. And A&M made a run to push that lead up to 13 where they, they ended up winning that game. Rice brings that basketball in the Hayes over to Jackson. The one thing about it, when these freshmen grow up. Oh, yeah. Y'all better look out. Foul on Tania Jackson. Tania Lawson fouling Jackson for Rice. Now Rice will be going to the line, shooting two. Three minutes and two seconds left in the first first quarter here. 13 to four, Rice leads the Lady Tigers of Texas Southern. Destiny Jackson makes the first. She's a senior out of Mansville, Texas, out of Timberview High School in Mansville, Texas. Players come out of Gra Dallas, Kevin. <laughs> players come Dallas and Houston, players come out of East. <laughs> so, <laughs> so she makes one out of two. Cameron Bates back in the game. I don't think Cameron has come out yet. Over to Avon in the corner. Tigers are cutting. Miss Gray on the cut. Cameron Bates for the three. She misses. Number three, Caitlin Crossway on the push after the rebound. Goes over to number five to Jackson. 
out of bounds. The basketball will be going to Rice. Wait a minute, Texas, uh, 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 Texas uh, Southern's uh, defense uh, is, is pretty good. I, you know, we just got to make some baskets on that one. Yeah, offense just got to match our defense. So Destiny Jackson comes out for the Lady Owls. Number 30, Jazzy Barnett comes in. Number 44, Hayes, foul Jada Belton again. She's young, and she's going to be getting in foul trouble. And, and what happens, uh, Jesse? She lets, the, she lets that lady, a young lady put her on her hip. And she's behind her. She's got to be three quarters. She's got to get to one side of her so she can deflect the ball. If, you got me on the, if I got you on my back, that's probably too quick. That's probably too quick. I'm going to just pull on you. Oh, you uh, you can't foul. Yeah, she'll get fouled. And guess what? Coach Chubbs. Got thir her third foul here in the first quarter. So Shelby Hayes at the line of freshman out of Cedar Park, Texas for Rice. She misses the first one. And she makes the second one. There's that's another Shelby sub. Hayes, right? Yeah, that's Shelby Hayes, correct. Now Tamia Hill subbing in for the Lady Tigers. So the Tigers have gone small. She's taking out Zion Reynolds. And Tamia Hayes. And tell me, uh, the next time down, watch for the press. When you go small like this, you usually press. I didn't see that foul at the call. That's on Michael Gray. <laughs> first foul first foul on Michael Gray. Guess what? It's early season for the refs, too. Okay? Early in the season for the refs. Well, they, they may need to get with it. It's about their sixth game, Robert. They, they, they should have been working out the kinks right now. Ennis for three with the miss. Another, out, yeah, they're a little bit big right now. Ashley Austin for the basket. 17-4. Lady Owls are up. One minute, 48 seconds left. Tamia Lawson with the basketball. Good cut by Gray. Good pass and a cut. Nice play. Once these young ladies grow up, Robert, they're, they're gonna be they're gonna be something to watch. Check it out. I'll come right back down and run that same action. They got to stop me on that one. <laughs> I run that same action when, <laughs> when I come back down the other end. Jazzy Barnett is dribbling up on the timeline. Cameron Bates guarding her. Yep. And there we go, Michael Gray on the rebound and the push. Oh, good jump stop. Missed the layup. Rice is on the push. In the corner. Page misses it. Basketball be going to Rice. Alisa Knight comes back in for the Lady Tigers. And also number 24 for the Tigers, Anella Thomas. Another another freshman out of Oakland, California. So Barnett gets the basketball. Calls out the play. Alisa Knight guarding Barnett. Barnett still dribbling. At least a night on the rebound. Adriana Avent on the push. She's going to pull up for the three. Bingo. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> 17-9. <laughs> Adriana Avent may be getting a shooting touch back. She's been in a slump the beginning of this season, but if she can start making some baskets, the Lady Tigers can get back in this basketball game real quick. She's a streaky shooter. You, you, if she's on, she's on. When she's getting a little cold, she just got to take it to the basket. So she's very athletic. Ten seconds up on the shot clock. Knight goes under the pick. Barnett dri drives. Austin oh. over to Ennis. Ennis for the three. Misses. Gets a foul. Foul on Rice. Lady That's Tigers. Oh, Chip. Oh, Chip Hayes. <laughs> <laughs> but if you look at it, Tigers have a shot in the basketball well here. The 17 to 9, 5.8 seconds left. And uh, and the Lady Tigers will be going to the foul, sh foul line shooting two shots. So if she can make both of these shots, to me and Hill, we can, we can get right back in this basketball game. Looking at the score, the score. It looks like they've been blowing us out. The way this game been going, it seems like they've been blowing us out. Yeah, they have. Yeah. You're right there. Yeah, they have. First shot is made. And the second shot for Tania here. 
she's a junior out of Honolulu, Hawaii. She's a transfer from University of Maryland, Baltimore County. So 5.8 seconds left. Three possession game. Good D. Travel, good defense. And like you said, Robert, the, the Lady Tigers have been playing great defense Absolutely. on the other end. Absolutely. Just couldn't make any shots. I'll take it. <laughs> now it's the end of the first quarter. Rice out 17. The Lady Tigers of Texas Southern University 11. Six point deficit here. End of the first quarter. We're going to take a break, Robert, and we'll be right back. And you're listening to Lady Tiger basketball. located at Holcomb and Almeida. Top, Rice, Barnett, there's a rebound, rebound for the Lady Tigers, number three, Tanaya Lawson, Lawson in the corner over to Alicia Knight, back to Lawson, over to Thomas, Thomas looks, looks to Reynolds, a vent in the corner, <laughs> offensive foul, only reason she got the offensive foul, Kevin, uh, the pick, you got to be patient with that shake deal, and you got to, and her man was on her, and they got to, they set up, they, they, they always get the big people to foul, because the guard in, in a hair of the cut, slow down, <laughs> slow down Barnett, until you cut somebody. Barnett brings it over to number 11, Swayze, back over to Barnett, <laughs> back over to Swayze, Swayze uh, from the three-point line. That, there she is. She cleared out real estate, Shelby Hayes. No, that was off. Okay. Thomas at the, at the point guard position for the Tigers. Unforced turnovers for, for the Tigers. And, again, that comes with the youth. That experience isn't there yet. Another freshman. Austin brings it in to, to Barnett. Barnett looks it over. Alicia Knight at the top defending Barnett. Barnett over to Jackson. Jackson looks. She swings it. 
number 22. Ashley Austin missed on the three. Barnett gets the rebound. She misses it. Alicia Knight with the rebound. Over to Tama. One thing about these freshmen that Coach Coach Vernet Skeet has brought in, they're, they're all athletic. Offensive foul by Thomas of the Tigers, which is her first. Another turnover. Be Cameron Bates will be checking in along with Michael Gray. Both will be coming back in. Hey, Coach had to take Thomas out of the game. You know why, Kev? Kev, you can't turn. Being a point guard, you can't turn the ball two or twice in a row. So you have to, you have to let her know, hey. And Robert, as bad as we're out. playing right now, 19-11, still in a basketball game. Cameron Who Bates on Jackson. Oh, yeah. Jackson back at the top. Good defense Great hit. by Lawson. Michael Gray on the switch with Swayze. Zion Reynolds with the rebound. Looks for the outlet pass. Cameron Bates brings the basketball up. Survey in the court over to Michael Gray. Block shot, jump ball, possession arrow will stay with the Tigers. 17 seconds left on the shot clock. Alicia Knight has got that skill herself. She let these freshmen just handle the ball and, 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 and make all the decisions. She got the assert herself. She plays hard. She got to assert herself right now. Inbounds pass to Lawson back over to Bates. Bates looking. 10 seconds left on the shot clock. Good pass. Ah, great pass over to Michael Gray. Blows the bunny. Jackson on the rebound. Over to Fisher. Alley oop. Basket for Rice out on the fast break. 21 11. Bates brings it up. Kevin, we missed a bunny on the other end, then give him a bunch on the other end. On the fast break. Got to get you deep, Kev. Cameron Bates, she works on that shot during practice. I watch her during practice. Robert Bates by Cameron Bates for three. Cameron Bates is becoming one of my favorites. <laughs> Cameron Bates. KB. Ooh. Good post action by Rice by Bellamy. Yeah. Cameron Bates. Bellamy. Yeah, Cameron Bates is bringing the basketball up 23-14. Tigers down 9, 6.35 left in the second quarter. Michael Gray claps for it. Shoots the three. Rice Owls on the push. Bellamy on the and shot misses. Ball out of bounds. Tigers basketball, six minutes, 23 seconds left in the second quarter. Me timeout.
Rice, 23, Texas Southern, 14. Texas Southern will be bringing the ball inbounds coming from left to right. Shania Lawson inbounds the ball over to Cameron Bates. Robin, you're kind of taking a liking to Cameron Bates. Over to Lucy Knight, back to Cameron Bates on the cut. Michael Gray. Michael Gray misses another one. Down low, Tigers have gone small again with Samir Hill down in the post. Lisa Knight gets her hand on the basketball. 21 seconds left on the shot clock. Like I said, you got to assert yourself. You see the score. Whatever you're looking to score, and you can make a defensive play right now. Bellamy at the top. Somebody blew a defensive assignment. Foul over the official who scores that 25-14. No communication on that play. On defense, you already you talk. The only person that's talking is Cameron Bates. Everybody else got to be talking. Cameron Bates brings the basketball up over to Michael over to Neil Lawson. To Neil Lawson for the three. No good. Tigers are getting one shot, and they're getting beat on the on the board. That's a push off on good with Cameron Bates. And the reason he's settling for the perimeter shot without getting it in burst. Let's throw it in the paint just a little bit. Get a paint touch and then kick it back out. Those kick pass are very, very makeable. Those just jacking them up from the outside. They're not makeable. That's something that they're going to have to learn yeah. being so young. Yeah. They're going. They're working out some of the kinks. That's why I said at least tonight is going to have to bring them along with him. Thomas back now. There's, there's your lane. Oh, got it again. Another block shot. And this possession will go as a tie-up. We'll go over to the Rice Owls with Michael Gray. I'll take that one, Kevin. She was aggressive. Going to the basket. Anytime Michael Gray going to the basket, I'll take it. Rice gets the basketball. Jackson up at the top to Bellman. They're cutting it. And Sunil Hill's getting lost. That's the second time she's gotten lost. And her young lady has made the basket. They ran that same little same action. play. Same play. We, now, Coach, we got we to gotta adjust to it. Thomas over to Michael Gray. Michael Gray over to Alisa Knight. Knight look over to Michael Gray. Michael Gray over to Adriana Avent for three. In and out. One shot for the Tigers. Jackson on the push. Over to number three, Sadie McCarthy. Cross court pass. One thing I, I, right now, Kevin, I'll change the defense on. I'll go into a zone right there, Coach. They keep saying, I'll just throw something. I think that's what Coach is about to do. She's in. Really. Yeah, step, yeah, stepped up. That's it. She went into a 2-3 zone. That will stop all of that flipping. See? Avent on the steal, on the push. Great Knights coach. running with her. Avent behind the back. Terrible shot. A collision course with two Tigers on the ground. Avent and Tania Hill. It was a foul, though, Kevin. I mean, I know you said it was a terrible shot. But she went to the basket aggressive and and jack contact and didn't get the box she tried to shoot that one in between but three players on that one <laughs> but i love how coach switched to the zone remember i said it before it happened and coach just said no you ain't gonna get that one on me again not again Two times. so she got in a sub again she took tania tania hill is out the, the slip got her twice not, you got to communicate on it, Kevin. That's all. When, when, when pushing you back, back to you like that, you just got to, you got to talk it through. Fisher inbounds the ball to Jackson. Jackson up top. Bellamy gets the pass. Hand off to him. Go over to Jackson. Now they talk. Jackson on the drive. Zion runs a little late on the defensive play. Rice beginning to stretch it out a little bit. 29-15, the Tigers kind of hang around on the first. Another freshman point guard. Avent pulls up for the three again. No good. Tigers are getting one shot. And Zion picks up the foul for the Lady Tigers. They may have to go into a full court press, kind of change it up a little bit. You're getting into foul trouble. But we got here, Robert, as well. We don't have two assists. I said that a long time ago. But you know what's so funny? Coach, 
was mad at that shot. Coach wanted Avac to get downhill. Get in the lane. Get in the great things happen when you get in the lane. Good defense by Thomas over to Ennis on a handoff. Firefoot misses the three. Bellamy on the offensive rebound. Passes it in the corner. Over to Fisher. Bellamy with the with the offensive rebound and the putback. 31-14. Rice is kind of stretching this game. Uh, stretching this lead out a little bit. Yeah, Zion Re Reynolds. I just need her to be a little bit more aggressive. She, she's, 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 she's bigger. She's taller. I just need her to be a little bit more aggressive in, in the paint right there. Thomas passes the ball over tonight. Kick ball by Rice uh, Jackson. Household subs coming in. Michael Gray is coming back in for number four. Adriana Aitman. Ball over the night. Coach seemed that looks at the top. Go ahead, Rob. Coach seemed to have confidence in number 24, uh, Anella Thompson. She, she, <laughs> Shot clock is running down. Yeah. Yeah. Turnover by the Tigers. Tigers aren't taking care of the basketball yeah. right now. The number of turnovers uh, at the last break. When we look here, we're at eight turnovers then but we made three or four since then I, I i i like the conversation between uh thomas and it was uh Tom Floor. Spin move. Another turnover by the Tigers. Number two, Ennis on the break. Looks over to Sam at the top of the free throw line. Offensive rebound. Michael Gray on the steal. One minute, 35 seconds left remaining in the second quarter. Tigers slow it down. Looking to get a good shot. Just want to get a a good attempt at the basket right now. Thomas calling it out. She goes over to Zion Reynolds. She looks, passes over to Lawson. Lawson looks on the drive and the spin. Puts Ooh. it up. Oh. Just won't fall for it. No, Kevin, they, let me tell you something. I like what they're doing. They, uh, all they're doing is stretching the defense out, widening the defense. We're a little bit quicker than their, their players, and we're just trying to get downhill on them, but we got to start making some of those shots. I mean, we can get into the paint, but we got to make the hand one. Put, put a little pressure on them. Lawson up and down, shooting two shots. 35-14, Rice Eyes leading. And she misses the free throw. I, I, li I like these two young ladies. They, they, they get out here and they play hard. They're scrapping on the defensive side. Oh, absolutely. Just gotta make That's all. Made one out of two, so we finally got off of that 14 point mark. Yeah, right now, got to make a stop right here over the fishing. That was a great play, Barnett on the drive. Vanilla Thomas bringing the basketball up for the Lady Tigers. She looks over, hand off the, over to Michael Gray, over to Lisa Knight. And there's a basket. You've been saying that, but she. <laughs> Come on, this. Look at it at the end of the day. Her stat sheet is filled up. She's going to rebound yes. and defend. Yes. She doesn't shoot a lot. Right. Come from an athletic family. Trey Knight, her brothers, good basketball, a okay. college basketball player. Dad was one, played at UCLA. I think her mom's an athlete. 
I mean, for, uh, for athletes, for, a family full of athletes. I just wanted to use it. 37-17, gets the ball in to Anella Thomas. Thomas looks over, she's talking to Lawson, bringing it up. Tigers trying to get another good shot, one possession at a time. There's Michael Gray, just can't make him today. She's getting to the cup, just can't yeah. make him. And I like how she, she uses, I like how Michael Gray uses her body to get to the basket. <laughs> And got the steal. <laughs> and that's the end of the quarter. Rice House 37, the Lady Tigers of Texas Southern 17.
ahead and share with us a little bit of his halftime stats. Well, I'm going to start with Rice first. We got Malia Fisher. What she got? She got 12 points. Ashley Austin got eight. Caitlin Crosswave, she's got three. Jackson, I mean, excuse me, Destiny Jackson, she's got three points. Go down a little bit. Dominique Ennis, she came off the bench. She's got two. India Bellamy, she's got four. Jazzy Owens, she's got two. And Fatu Sam, she's got two. And uh, we're, we're, we're with those Shelby Hayes. Shelby Hayes, I, I like her rebounding. She came in and she got one point. But for the Lady Tigers, let's talk about them. We, we got 20, 17 points is all we scored, Kevin. But our leading scorer was Michael Gray, which is no surprise. But Lisa Knight got two. Uh, who's that? Tania Lawson. She's had, she has two. But Cameron Bates, she just she got three. Who else we got? Um, Tamika, Tamia, Tania Hill, she has two. Adrian Anna Avant, she has three. And that rounds out the 17 points for the Texas Southern Tigers. Lady Tigers, Kevin, we got to do something to change the tempo of this game. Because, Kevin, they, they you know, we, we, had, we had a chance and we just we can't make a shot. Can't make a shot. What we're going to have to do as well is take care of the basketball. We're going to have to take care of that basketball and cut down on some of the turnovers. Yeah, you know, Robert, if we, we can get some more attempts at the basket so that's one thing that we're going to have to clean up and, and and that way we get more attempts at the basket we'll be able to, to get, get some more points here as well cameron Bates is going to be have to be a little bit more aggressive along with lisa knight yeah i think to give us a chance here this third quarter and kevin i press it we can't lose it. we can't I'll, I'll press this team i'll press rice let's let, let's make rice get up and down the floor with us we got athletes Tigers are going to come back with Cameron Bates at the point guard along with Tania Lawson, Jada Belton, Michael Gray as well. The same as the starting five in the beginning. Yeah, it looks like a little bit more action here. Another turnover by the Lady Tigers. They're getting paint touches down there, Kevin. Uh, yes. get, getting the ball right there in the perimeter, right there in the restricted lane. Uh, good things are going to happen for you if you keep doing, allowing that. Ashley Austin scores that. Cameron Bates brings it up to, to Lawson. Lawson dribbles up, double team. Michael Gray, she'll let it go. Michael Gray misses that. Jada Belton is doing what she does. If she can stay out of foul trouble yes. here, Robert, and, and, and do what she does, she blocks shots, runs the floor, and, and, and give you second chance opportunities at, 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 on the offensive end, we have a chance. I see some promise in her, Kevin. You were telling me about her. Uh, now she get a quick foul. All she did is pivot it. What, what game is the referee watching? Not quite seeing that foul all she, she did is foul. pivot zion Rummel comes in for jada belton that's her fourth personal foul but again being so young and i don't want to harp on that so yeah, much yeah. just going to have to have to go through that oh yeah see that a little bit yeah you learn on the adversity especially in this game why wouldn't we pick up the ball Zion Reynolds is going to have to come out and challenge that shot. And Malia Fisher scores that basket. Cameron Gray swings it over to Lawson. Lawson looks. Ooh. And a foul on the drive. But when you say, if we go down here and drive to the basket, then good things will happen. Yes, sir. So, so here comes Adriana Avent in. I think Coach Vernet Skeet is looking for her to give her some instant offense because she's going to have to get back in this game pretty quick, 41-17 right now. Uh. Adriana, eight bent for the three, Rob. She's looking forward <laughs> to give her some quick instant offense. That's my girl. back in this game quick. That's my girl. To. That's instant offense. That's what I call it, Kevin. 
instant offense. Ashley Austin again down on Zion Reynolds. Tigers are going to have to double that in the post. If not, all of our bigs are being foul trouble. So I think something she's going to have to double that post. Adriana Avin again for the three. No good. Austin on the rebound. Good pickup by Cameron Bates. Cameron Bates. KB. Cameron Bates is playing good defense for the Tigers. Tigers didn't get a, uh, get a basket there, but we get another attempt with the turnover. Avan again. Cash him out. She haven't been shooting the basketball well so far this, this year. Once she gets going, turnover Rice. Turnover Rice. 43 20. Tigers is just staying at the same spot. If they can play good defense and get the opportunity to start making some baskets, may kind of just creep into this. Don't want to get it all at once. Just no, chip away at it. Chip away at it. Yeah. And, and it all starts on the defensive end. You got to get stops. Got to get stops. Got to get stops. Get a stop, get a make. Get a stop, get a make. Get a stop. Get a stop get a make. I, I call it get three stops in a row. Let's see if we get three stops in well, a row. That's again. one. I'm going to give them that one. Michael okay. Gregory with the basketball. Turnover. Foul on Cameron Bates. Jackson be going to the line for two. Coach Skeet is trying to find that combination. Yes. On where is she? Where where can I get some some good continuity going here? We're getting two minute turnover. One on Harper again as their freshman. They're gonna have to cut some of that down. You have to take it. These freshmen got another month, right? Because in January. January for all the marbles. January 2nd, all the marbles. So they have to grow up over in, in, in the next month. They got to just grow up, Kevin. Grow up quick. Yes. But a month is a lot of time. A month is a lot of time. It's confidence to me. What I'm looking at is just lack of confidence right now. No, no Kevin. Bad no pass Kevin. by... Cameron, Cameron Bates. Bates. Fast but, break back to about Jackson. But, but to help Cameron, it, it let you know about Cameron, Zion Re Re Reynolds is not fighting for the position in there. Cameron, the play is to get the ball on the inside, but Reynolds has to fight for the ball. Adrian Avent on the spin and the miss. Jackson on the push. Rice with the miss. Dominique Cameron one stop. Bates. Cameron Bates is on the push. Okay. That's one stop now. We're, let's see if we can get a make. Because they were used to getting a stop, but we're not getting a make. <laughs> let's get a make. She's not fighting for the ball. Cameron. I mean, Zion Williams. Uh, Reynolds. I'll take that. I'll take that. Tania Hill on the miss on the drive. Zion Reynolds over the back. It's another foul. Six minutes, two seconds left remaining in the third quarter. Her third foul. Rice will be going from left to right. And there are Thomas back in the basketball game. Jackson for Rice brings the ball up. She goes over to Ennis. Ennis looks. Rice makes the cut. Back to Jackson. Hayes with the pick. Jackson with up and under. Ennis with the rebound. Everybody's on the floor for the rebound. Guess who, guess who came up with it? Shelby A. <laughs> <laughs> She's cleared <laughs> out. <laughs> Possession arrow goes over to Rice. 18 seconds left remaining. On the shot. Five minutes, 38 seconds. Rice, 46. Texas Southern, 20. You have your buddy out there cleaning the floor. Out there, Mr. Yeah, Hattie. I see him. I see him. Oh, ski boat. Yeah. Yeah. Did a good job. Good job. I like the wrist action. <laughs> <laughs> With that wrist action, you think you can make a three? <laughs> good steal by Knight. 
Knight on the play. Pass it, pass it. Javen. And the foul. Maybe she passed it one step game. earlier. The defense would have had to commit. She could have got it back. Yeah. What I do like about this team, I'm watching them. They're not getting down on themselves. They're, they're behind. They, they're not getting down on them. You know, like, woe is me. They saying, okay, let's, let's. I guess it's uh, because of the coach. Because the coach, she seemed like she's still in the game, too. Oh, yeah. She, don't, she ain't not going to let him quit. Avon on the miss first free throw. Looks like a free throw attempt. She makes it. Making one out of two. At the half, Texas Southern was shooting. Half court press. 70% from the free throw line. Shelby Fisher from Causeway. Rice is trying to give a little pressure. They're picking up half. It's token pressure. <laughs> hey, Finn, again, she pulls it from the three. Shelby Hayes on the rebound. Good defense Ooh, by Thomas. Good, good defense. But so, those are some of the things that you pick out that they're doing well. Oh, yeah. Shelby Hayes from the free throw line with the assist from Crosswork. And as you say, that they're not getting down on themselves. They just no. keep fighting. Mark my word, in a month, this is going to be a better team. Thank you, ref. I was beginning to think that the ref came from over there off the university. <laughs> we have a timeout on the court. Four minutes and 41 seconds remaining. Third quarter, Rice 50, your Lady Tigers 21. We'll be right back with Lady Tiger basketball. Hello, Tiger Nation. This is Kevin Granger. I would like to personally invite you to come out and join the newly established TSU Athletic Directors Legends Club. Members of the TSU AD Legends Club will receive TSU Athletic Apparel, a championship ring from a...
And we're back here in the spacious H&PE Arena here on the campus of Texas Southern University. Adriana Avan will be at the line shooting two shots. She makes the first. Four minutes and 41 seconds remaining in the third period here. Shooting the second. She makes them both. 50 to 23. To Neil Hill, and they're picking up in a one-two-two press. Adriana Avent picks up that foul. Second personal foul here for Adriana Avent. Rice will take the basketball out on the sideline. Barnett back in the game at the point over the crossway. Good by Alyssa Knight. Nella Thomas gets the basketball for the Tigers. She's crossing. Fisher is leading, uh, defending Thomas. Finally got the ball to Zion Reynolds, a handoff. Thomas looking. Cross court pass. Knight. Jump shot. Miss it. Thomas with the offensive glass. Goes up. Fisher with the block. <laughs> Looks like a phantom foul on that one. Thomas said, oh, my God. Fifth team foul. Rice will be going to the line. Four minutes remaining here in the third period. 50 to 23. Cameron Bates enters the basketball game for the Lady Tigers. Coach, I'm liking this young group, Coach. I'm sitting watching, you know, Thinking about last year and thinking about this group right here, we got some young, promising young ladies with great attitudes that that seem like they ready. To, they they ready to do something. I mean, I'm sitting just watching them. Being here, this is your first time seeing them, and I'm quite sure you'll see them much more um, during yeah, the season. season. Yeah, and you'll see them grow up before your eyes. Yeah, I can't so, wait. Adrian Avon over to Tania Hill. Hill's on the push. She pushes over to Cameron Bates. Bates brings it back out. You have 10 seconds remaining on the side, shot clock. Zion Reynolds on the, on the pick. Cameron Bates with the three-point attempt. No good. Barnett passes it over to Crossway. Crossway's cross-court pass. Haley Swayze. Cool. Cool. I would love to be in the game film office. After this game, when they go watching film, I may not. I, I, I would love to be. It's just so many teaching points that coach, and I knew she was going to take uh, Zion Williams, uh, Reynolds out. She was guarding her man instead of the guarding the basket. Just little stuff like that, being young, it just, it just not ingrained in you yet. You got to guard the man. You got to guard the person with the ball is the most dangerous person out there. Always got to think about him. So I'm just watching, Coach. I'm, oh, yeah. I can't wait to see They're gonna go what's up. in store for me Swayze, later in the season. Swayze makes both of her shots. You have Mary Myopo back in the basketball lane along with Michael Gray. Pass goes over to Michael Gray. Back to Alyssa Knight. Knight over to Cameron Bates. Cameron Bates calls out the play. Comes off of the screen. Over to Avent. Avent for another three. She misses the shot. Alyssa Knight's all over the court right now. This is the thing that she does. She doesn't give you many points, but she gives you everything else. She gives you energy. Gives you rebound. The tip basketballs that a lot of doesn't show up on the score sheet, but she gives you all of that. But it shows up in the locker room because it's up on the board in the locker room how many tip passes you get. It's a hustle play. Yeah. They call it deflections. Lady Tigers will be taking that basketball out right in front of their home bench. Cameron Bates will be inbounding the basketball. Gets it over to Alyssa Knight. Knight back to Bates. 25 seconds on the shot clock. She goes off with a pick and roll. Avent again from the corner. Finally makes that one. If she gets going, 
she can score in bunches and she can score them real quick. Cash them out. The same play. Exactly. They have to rotate on that back side. Now what happens, uh, uh, the post player, whoever's playing in the post, they just running them out. Stay there, stay where you at. Let you protect the basket. Driving to the basket, another positive play. Yeah. Picks up a foul against Rice. Foul number 30, Jazzy Owens. Oh, that foul to be on Jazzy Barnett, number 30 for Rice. Avanna be back at the line, shooting two. May get a rhythm because now she's getting in a flow right now, getting fouled. She just made a three-pointer, made one prior to that. So she may be able to get that shooting touch back. I'm, I'm watching what they're doing on the offensive end. Rice is lifting us to the free throw line and leaving the backside, the, the, the basket open. And they just taking it off and going to the basket. We, uh, our post players just got to lay in the paint a little bit. Adriana Bavin makes both of them. Cameron Bates picks up Barnett, full court. Watch. Bates is working her, turning her over to Jackson. Jackson to Knight. Knight is defending Jackson off of the pick. Fisher at the top against Myopo. Uh, what did he call? Foul on Mary Myopo. I didn't see the foul. I thought that was really good defense. Move the feet well. I didn't see the foul, but uh, the fish is a little bit closer than I am. So, hey. Yeah. I thought they was going to give Melissa, going to call some on Melissa Fisher for dribbling too much. That's what I thought. Because she, she beat the heck out of the ball. And she goes to the line and makes both free throws. No pass. Cameron Bates brings the ball up court over to Avon. Avon dribbles over to Michael Gray. Michael Gray from the free throw line. She misses it. Rebound. Over to Barnett. Barnett passes the ball over to Jackson. Jackson is looking down to Fisher. Good block by Knight. Jackson gets her own rebound up for two. Cameron Bates brings the ball up the court. Coach Vernet Skeet still coaching really, really hard on the sideline. Avent pops out. She's getting to that line. Making it happen off of the dribble. Getting inside of the paint as you've been stating. If she get in the paint, as athletic as she is, I mean it'll just put a lot more pressure on them. But Kevin, we gotta get stops. Kevin, we've down thirty two points. We gotta get stops on the other end and makes on this end. Like I said, we just gotta get three stops. We got to string three stops in a row and three scores in a row. I call that one kill. If we can get two two or three kills in a row, we're back in the game. If not, uh, the time is going to be against us. Avin makes the first foul shot. 60 to 29. Tania Hill at the timeline, mm. at the shot clock, ready to check in. She misses the second one. Tigers are still playing hard. All they right. haven't had any quit in them. Still by Michael Gray. Michael Gray on the push. Over to Cameron Bates. Cameron Bates, she's looking. You'd have to get that ball over to Michael Gray or Adriana Avent right now. Right. Avent has been carrying the last three possessions down, down the court. Be patient. Cameron, Cameron Bates Dead on Bates. offensive, offensive glass. What's my point guard from last year? Ty Bridges, she's a grad assistant. Where's she at? She's side over side. there. Yeah, Ty Bridges. I get, I, she got that Ty Bridges in her. Yes. That is amazing. I knew she was going to be a coach. Thank, thank you, Kevin. <laughs> thank you. I knew she was going to be a coach. Cameron Bay shooting two at the line, the first one. She misses.
It's gonna have to. It's gonna take some time with these young ladies, but they're fun to watch. Oh, absolutely. Misses them both. There's Mayor Myopo out to Cameron Bates over to oh. Avent. Avent to the top of the three. She yeah. makes them. They're a lot of fun to watch, Kevin. She, she, a lot of fun she's to watch. Scoring bunches, Alyssa Knight. <laughs> Rice gets the basketball down the court. <laughs> Bellamy will be at the line shooting one shot. Was that another foul on Avon? No, that was on Mayor Mayopo. Okay. Got 15.4 seconds remaining uh, in the third quarter. Bellamy completes the three-point play. Tigers going to have to get a good shot here where Rice won't be able to get another attempt. Five seconds left. Cameron Bates. Cameron Bates. He's playing hard. She giving you everything she got, Kevin. She gonna have a good night's sleep tonight, Kevin. <laughs> 63, 34. Rice is up with 1.9 seconds remaining on the here in the third quarter. Looks like there's blood on the jersey. Officials are. Stopping the clock. That's Haley Swayze. <laughs> Got a break in the action right here, Robert. The Tigers are down. It's at 29 points right now. So there, there's, there's some good things that you can take oh, out of this basketball game. Of course we can. Thing. To, to show some growth. Like you said, film should be interesting. I, I'm telling you, I love to be in that film room. I'm serious. No, because I will help point out some of the points. I'm not just saying the coach going to be barking. The coach going to be it's going to be teachable moments. Say if we just do this, we just do this, we'll be a better team. Cameron Bates will be trying to complete the three-point play. She makes that one right here. We don't need a foul or anything to get him to the line. Cameron Bates comes up with the steal. Kevin. You can find some players here. Yeah.
And we're back here in the spacious H&P Arena here on the campus of Texas Southern University. Rice University is 63, the Lady Tigers 35. Austin inbounds to play the pass over to Barnett. Barnett looks, gets the pick from Austin. He looks down to Bellamy. Swayze with the jump shot. Rebound, Cameron Bates. Cameron Bates on the push. Over to Mayor Myopo. Pass it back out to Bates. Bates look. Dribble handoff over the night. Myopo looks. Gets a foul against Bellamy. First team foul here in the fourth quarter. Nine minutes and 29 seconds remaining. Kevin, can I get a shout out to Tall Ken? Tall Ken in the chat room? He's in the chat room. Who else we got in the chat? The Immortal 16? <laughs> Obey Hakeem? Shout out to y'all. Thank y'all for joining us in the chat room. Tanya Gray over to Myopo. 19 seconds remaining. Pass the basketball out to Cameron Bates. Fisher blows the whistle. I think there's a shot clock. I'm going to talk in regards to the shot clock. You're, you're <laughs> looking at Tall Ken, huh? Tall Ken said either the, the graphic person is slow or the announcer of the TSU graduates. <laughs> <laughs> but Tom Ken has to realize that the that the uh, the feed is a little behind. Yeah, yeah, that's all right. But we pray for him. Oh yeah, Tom Ken. Ken. Where did you graduate from? Where did you graduate from? Tiger Nation. This is Kevin Granger. I would like to personally invite you to come out and join the newly established TSU Athletic Directors Legends Club. Members of the TSU AD Legends Club will receive TSU Athletic Apparel, a championship ring from a select sport when applicable, season tickets for football, basketball, and the TSU Relays. Special recognition at a home athletic event and much more. To join or for more information, visit tsusports.com or call 
And in the spacious H&P Arena, the Tigers are down 63-35. Cameron Bates, I know we've been, oh, we've been calling her name out a number of times. And this foul is on Jada Belton, which is her fifth foul set in the pick. And it's stated this is something she's going to have to learn. Once she sets the pick, she's going to have to stay there, and that guard is going to have to do the job to come come off of her. Yes. Just got to be patient. The guard got to be patient. That's what has to happen. Jada Rice out has the basketball. Good and back in the Bellamy. The officials are looking at one another. She calls a travel. Travel on good and under, up and under. Now we're cooking with hot grease right now. <laughs> Adriana Avin will take the basketball out. The Tigers are going from right to left this fourth quarter. Cameron Bates is calling out the signal. Come on a dribble handoff to Adriana Avin on the spin. Good Up move. Good move. Adriana Avent. So now that looks like she she's in rhythm now. <laughs> Gave her that Kevin McHale move. Up the, and up under. And, yes, sir. Cameron Bates. She's guarding Barnett. Same play, dragging the our post player up high. She's coming off the pick, just getting right to the basket with no resistance. Keep your head up. Rice on the push. <laughs> Bellamy misses on rebound. <laughs> Onto Austin. Cameron Bates on the steal. Has Avin on the left. She gets fouled. Cameron Bates will be going to the line for two shots. And Kevin, on that fast break, I'm sorry, on that, on that fast break, Adrian and Avant should have went straight to the basket. She's so used to shooting three, she veered out, and that allowed the defender to go guard both of them. She had to be a threat. She should have been a threat, and then uh, uh, KB would have had a wide open layup. Cameron Bates. Yeah, back KB. At the line. Kobe Shooting Bryant, too. Cameron Bates, same thing. <laughs> same thing. <laughs> <laughs> First free throw attempt is missed. She'll be shooting the second free throw. She misses both. To Nia Hill. Gets the offensive rebound. Now that's amazing to me, the referees, how they able to, to watch the game and watch the clock. I, I find that so amazing. They do a great job. Can't get move. a break there. Adrian Avent. Cash him out. From the three. Barnett gets the offensive rebound. Cameron Bates garden. Swayze. Swayze for the three for the right side. Haley Swayze. It's a nice name. Tigers down 68-37. Cameron Bates calling out the Sigurds over to Tamir Hill. Tamir Hill from the elbow. Swayze on the rebound. Let me tell you something. Tania Hill shot that like she knew what she was doing. She can make them. I see. She can make them. Shot it with confidence as well. I'd like to see her shoot another one. It looks like Cameron Bates is out there. She's been playing hard. Not sure if she's getting a little winded at this point or not. But she's still out there playing yeah. hard. Lady Tigers going. Michael Gray defending. Defending Fisher. Swayze in the corner. Fisher. Uh -oh. Hill on the good defense by the Tigers. Knight on Swayze. Cameron Bates on Barnett. Just beat her to the spot. Good box out good by box. Michael Gray. Elisa Knight with the rebound, Cameron Bates. Cameron Bates crossing the timeline. Over to Tania Hill. Keep shooting it. I like it. 
Tigers will get the dead ball rebound. 68 37, 6 minutes, 26 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Knight from the three point line from the corner. Ooh. She misses. Ooh. Is there a jump ball call? Jump ball call. Texas Southern will get the ball from the possession now. Thank you, Coach, because I, I was going to give her an oxygen mask over here. Cameron Bates need a, a breather. Tania Hills back into the basketball game. Let it go back. Let it go back. Yeah. Michael Gray over to Tania Thomas. I like Thomas too. I like another, Thomas too, Kevin. Freshman. Kevin, it's going to be an exciting season for me to follow these ladies all over the country and, and call the games on the radio on KTSU Sports. Offensive rebound for Rice, number 44, Hayes gets another rebound. 68, 39, five minutes and 56 seconds remaining. We got Taylor Baylor. Taylor Bella. Taylor Bella talking about fixed audio. Thank you, Taylor. Oh, my girl there. Yeah. <laughs> Neil Thomas. Good pass. Outlet pass to Avent. Oh. Oh, a little sleight of hand there, Kevin. Time out, Texas Southern, 68-41. Rice leading, five minutes, 42. In PE Arena here on the campus of Texas Southern University. Five minutes, 42 seconds remaining here in the fourth quarter. Tigers are picking up full court. Jackson is a one lady press breaker. Tanil Thomas is guarding.
Tigers with the rebound. Tanel Thomas is coming from right to left. Over to Mary Mayopo. Over to Michael Gray. Michael Gray back up top to Thomas. 15 seconds remaining on the shot clock. Dribble hand off to Gray. Over to Mayopo. Mayopo from the top. Misses. Rebound. Crossway. Over to Jackson. Jackson dribbling down. Pass to Fisher. Two point basket by Rice. 70 to 41 Rice over the Lady Tigers of Texas Southern. Turnover by Avent. Good block by Avent. Tigers are still playing hard. They play hard, they man. They play hard. <laughs> Hey, you know. the they, they get back on the defensive on the defensive side. <laughs> I love this game. Rice on the inbounds pass, swings over the crossway. Alisa Knight. Alisa Knight. On the defensive side, hands on the basketball. Tanil Thomas dribbles it. Over the locker. Good pass. Over the hill. Michael Gray on the offensive rebound. And, and you was pointing some things out to me tonight before the game. You was telling me about Michael Gray, and you showed me the game she scored a lot in. She's struggling to uh, score the basketball tonight. When you're struggling to score the basketball, Kevin, you got to find other things on the basketball court you can do to help your team. And uh, and she looks she's bright, she's smart. Uh, I want to see her on the defensive end, pick up her defensive intensity. And uh, I can't wait till the swag start. She makes one out of two. 70 to 42, Rice leading. Thomas on, on the basketball. Jackson passes it over to Fisher. Fisher looking for Hayes. Hayes down low. Tigers are still, still scrapping on the floor. Possession arrow go to Rice, 13 seconds remaining. Three minutes and 47, 49 seconds remaining in this contest. Tigers haven't given up. There's one thing about this, when you're young like this and you play hard, eventually good things will start happening for you. Absolutely. And, and, and remember, Kevin, I, we're going to revisit this toward midseason. Uh, uh, Nella, Nella Thomas. Good block by Tamia she, Hill. She, she's going to be a viable part of this team. She's going to be a viable part of this team. Lawson on the break, pass it over to Thomas. Thomas barking out signals. Dribble handoff over to Tamia Hill. Skip pass over to Michael Gray. In that case, Kevin, you can't throw the chest pass. You got to either throw a lob or you got to do a bounce pass. Three minutes, 27 seconds remaining. Rice 70, Texas Southern 42. Austin on the break. It's Amir Hill defending Two that two-point basket by Austin. 72-42 is the score. Lawson dribbling the basketball. She's looking. A, a lot of one-on-one -on -one play right now. Yeah, but they're spreading it out, and I think they're trying to get to the back. They're just dribbling. They're taking too many dribbles. You can play one-on-one -on -one without a thousand dribbles. One, two dribbles, get to the basket and get up off it. Michael Gray with that offensive rebound. Tania Thomas. Tania Hill with the miss. Yeah. Sam with the rebound for Rice. Rice is empty in the bench now. Rice is swinging it around. Alyssa Knight with the rebound, passes the hill. Good outlet pass over to Michael Gray and the basket. 
these are some of the things that you look at right now. They have a quick plan, but they're, you know, finding their spots and spots still looking good. But it, it, like you say, we'll revisit midseason and see where they are. Kevin, you know what I would do if I was these kids? If, I, if you really, really want to get better, I know it's Turkey Day tomorrow, Thanksgiving tomorrow, and uh, but I would say, Coach, I, I, I just need to get some more shots up. Coach, they'd have to put me out of this gym tonight. If I, if, if yep. I'm looking at the shoot percentages, uh, we got five for 22, 11 for 50, five for 20, uh, two, four, 11 for 50. I'd be in the gym. I said, Coach, I, I know I'm going on a Christian break, but I got to get me some shots up. Is all right? Can I get me some shots up? Because that's how you get better this day. We've had enough shots, Kevin. We just, we've been shot takers, but we hadn't been shot makers today. Michael Gray misses that free throw attempt. Ballon for the rebound. That ball goes out against Texas Southern. Two minutes, 20 sec 29 seconds remaining in the contest. <laughs> Ashland Zhang is in the game. For Rice, good strip by Lisa Knight for the basket. Tigers are speeding up the tempo a little bit. Foul on Tania Hill. I think this is something that coach can look at right here and find out with this pace of the game. They may play a little bit better. Number 32, Gooden, will be inbounding the pass over to Zhang. Zhang is a freshman out of pa South Pasadena, California. Cameron Hill. The defender, Lisa Knight again. It looks like she got a on that one. I think that that may be a bad call. That call came from baseline, and you had an official oh, sitting right at the top here. That could have been her fourth steal tonight. She got three already. <laughs> hey, Dwayne Thomas, I guess it's some kin to uh, Anella Thomas, said, yes, it is Anella Thomas. Austin makes both of the free throws for Rice. Two minutes, six seconds remaining in this contest. Rice 74, your Lady Tigers 46. Nella Thomas over to Michael Gray. Michael Gray on the pull up. Basket. Wow. 74 48. That's what you were telling me about. That's, that's a beautiful pull up jump shot. Too much, too much, too little, too late. No, like you say, these are some of the things that they can take with them that they've done well tonight. But then there's some of the things that they're going to have to work on. I think this 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 Lady Tiger team is going to surprise some people in, in our conference. Absolutely. Good at the line. She'll be shooting two. Short on the free throw. And it, and it don't stop stop here. On Monday they travel to Ole Miss. Pretty good team down there. Real good team. Great coach down there. She misses both free throws to Neil Hill with the rebound. One minute, 45 seconds remaining in the contest. Cameron Bates coming from right to left. Tigers are still setting up plays. These are some things that Coach Renee Skeet knows that she's going to have to work on. Good on the push. Swayze. Over to Sam. Back to Austin. Cameron Bates. Over to Michael Gray. Mr. Bunny. <laughs> the little general. Cameron Bates. Cameron Bates. Cameron Bates. Battling. Offensive rebound. Going to go to the line shooting two. <laughs> Rice making household changes and bringing in a new five here with one minute and seven seconds remaining. Mary Myopo will come in for the Lady Tigers for Michael Gray. Kevin, I, I don't see that much in college basketball no, no more. It used to be coming. Some coaches take all five out, all five in. Uh, 
Cameron I, Bates makes the first free throw. I guess with the transfer portal, you can't do that. <laughs> I call it portal combat. She misses the second one. One minute remaining in the contest. One minute remaining. Hey. hey, Bates is unbelievable, Kevin. Cameron Bates still on top of that point guard. Jackson makes the layup for the right side. Cameron Bates on the push. <laughs> Tiger still running a play. Dribble drive. Uh. Cameron Bates. <laughs> Crossway with the rebound. Barnett want to run the clock out. 15 seconds remaining in this contest. Tiger still pressing the basketball. Blocked by, by Lisa Knight. Lisa Knight. Bates will just dribble the clock out here. And this will be the end of the basketball game here. Robert Rice, Owl 76, Texas 7, 49. And, and I'm, I'm At the end of this basketball game, the Rice Owls 76, the Lady Tigers of Texas Southern 49. What are your thoughts of, of this afternoon's game? Kevin, I'm trying to see. I'm just trying to, we got out rebounded. Let me look at the rebounds. We got out rebounded 56 to 30.